Mrs. Walsh. My dear, I, uh, suppose... By so many different names, we've grown together to serve you. Mrs. Walsh. My dear, I, uh... I saw you come out here a few minutes ago. I know we probably shouldn't be seen together, oh, don't but I... Really, for heaven's sake, it's a wedding reception. Anybody can talk to anybody at a wedding reception. <laughs> <laughs> the groom and the bride are having the final photograph taken at the church. They ought to be here shortly. <laughs> oh, well, good. Well, maybe we should go inside. Uh, this day has been something of an ordeal for me. <laughs> I really just came out here because I want to catch my breath. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know you wanted to be alone. I... That's all right. By the way, you weren't at the church. What happened? Oh, I, uh, I had some business to attend to. How was it? Oh, uh, I couldn't do anything to prevent it. <laughs> and I hope they're going to be happy, and I hope they have what they want. But from here on in, I'm not going to think about them anymore. I'm going to think about me. I'm going to think about my needs, my private needs, my professional needs. And you're very important to me, darling, so I'll drink to that. <laughs> It's ringing. You reach the office of Arthur Claiborne. If you leave your message after the beep, I'll return your call as soon as possible. Gavin, if this is you... Same message we've been getting all afternoon. I appointment, but I should be back in the office by 12.15 at the latest. Mr. Claiborne, this is Lieutenant McCluskey, Oakdale Police. We've been trying to reach you for the past several hours. Please, contact me on important police business as soon as you get this message. Well, if he's there, he's not picking up. Why don't we try Kruger's office again? What would be the point? Jay Sullivan said Arthur was there, had a meeting on the retirement village with Ellen and Ralph Mitchell, left right away, and she'd call if she heard anything from him. I can't get over thinking that what happened to Philippe was my fault. You know, I'll never get over seeing him floating in the river like oh, that. Stop it. Do not blame yourself for this, all right? Whoa, whoa, hey! Mm -hmm. How you oh, doing, honey? Oh, Joe, I'm great. Oh, yeah, you know, I thought if I was lucky enough to get out of Iowa today, I'd be here in time for Holden and Larry's wedding. Not to get back here to investigate another murder. about seeing Lucinda and Marcy talking on the terrace. Because all along, Marcy has insisted that she hardly knows Lucinda. I I'm starting to think that Evan's right, that they really are in cahoots. I mean, what were they toasting about out there when we walked out? Oh, come on, Connor. People toast things at weddings all the time. And you know your brother's suspicious of his own shadow. After all, Marcy just signed a big new contract. Well, but that doesn't mean that she hasn't decided that she can't rise up even faster with Lucinda's help. Well, I guess that's oh. true. <laughs> I mean, you were under contract to Walls while you and Evan were plotting your big takeover. Are you ever going to let me forget How about a little champagne? Okay. Let's go. You did?
portion brought to you today by Dr. Recommended Natural Fiber Metamucil. And you could be regular for the rest of your life. You know, on sale, name brand. So I switched from my gone to another liquid, and that's when I learned that a bargain in the store went <laughs> in my sink. I mean, I had to add more of that stuff just to finish the pan. <laughs> Some value. Not like my dawn. Look, the suds come back, proving Dawn still got the power to keep on cleaning. Will I switch again? <laughs> I'm thrifty, not crazy. Dawn takes grease out of your way. And that's the real value. I've had my share of sore throats. I just went to the doc with a doozy. Know what he suggested for fastest relief? Poor septic. Doc was right. I could actually feel the pain go away in seconds. More doctors recommend chloroseptic spray for fastest relief because chloroseptic's powerful medicine penetrates nerve endings on contact. I can't prevent a sore throat from ever coming back. But when it does, I don't have to suffer. For fastest relief, doctors say chloroseptic spray. I can't wait to use my new Corning Visions cookware. Corning is so smart. They came out with a new cranberry color just in time for Thanksgiving. Yeah, and they've made their saucepans non-stick. They must have known I'd be doing the cooking. I've got to get some more batteries. Oh, good. Rayovac alkalines are on sale. Why do we need so many? Because everything in our house runs on batteries. I don't. No, you run on cookies. <laughs> Ever since they changed Kmart, Bob says I spend too much time here. How insensitive. That's the last I saw Felice, until we got that phone call from the yacht club. Somebody spotted a body floating in the river. <sighs> you know, my first thought was Felice, and then we got there, my worst fears were realized. Why? Why did you think it was Felice? Just a gut feeling, Martha. Well, we all had that. When Murphy turned the body over, well, there was no mistaking those bruises on his neck. Well, not to mention, Felice knew he had enough on Arthur to implicate him in the break-in and Carol. What, now, he, he said that specifically? Well, he said that he had enough information that the police could, could nail Arthur for Carolyn's murder. What are you thinking, Mother? It's just... It's, and it's another crime open on the books. Namely, Dana's kidnapping and the missing two million in ransom money. And I was just so hoping that when I finally tracked down the deposit that Arthur's made in Arthur's account in Des Moines, it wouldn't be a measly 5,000 or a measly million. Well, then we could have moved in on Arthur. Any luck? Nothing. Oh. I sent Murphy over to the warehouse to see if Arthur was there or just not answering the phone. The place seemed totally deserted. It was locked up tighter than a drum. Uh, well, I'm going to try him again. All right, so what was found on the body? No, uh, passport, wallet with ID, hotel keys, nothing that would indicate what Philippe had, had on Arthur, though. Anyone notify next to Kit? Uh, there's no information in the wallet as to who to call. Daryl pointed out Gavin was a friend. We didn't tell him because he might have tipped off Arthur. Besides, he's supposed to be with Barbara at Holden and Lily's wedding. Well, he's got to be told eventually, and I don't know. As for Arthur, really all we can do at this point is bring him in and question on what Philippe's told you, Daryl. Well, same message. Out on an important meeting. Should be back by 12.15. You know what we really have to find out is when exactly Arthur got to that meeting at Kruger's. And then I'm going to go over to Lakeview and talk to Kruger myself. Yeah, Jade Sullivan, please. Detective Margo Hughes. All right, squeeze in really tight. All right. Uh, uh, thank you. Good. Oh, what a... Hi. Hi. Yes, are you? I'm sorry I'm late. I had one emergency after another. You look fabulous. Thank you. Did you talk to Philippe? No, but I left a message at his hotel room. No. About that blackmail. Philippe? No. Well, that's what we both assumed, but it wasn't signed. Philippe is the only person on this earth that knew that I slept with Daryl in Rome. Exactly, which is why I want you to destroy it as soon as we get back to your... I burned it already. I can't help you. He's walking around with knowledge that could destroy food. Darling, I yeah. swear you have nothing to worry about. Now, come on, I want to offer my congratulations to the new So have you guys set a date yet? Uh, no, not until after the trial. When does it start? 
the end of next week, but uh, we're not talking about it today, right? Well, we're only happy. Well, I wouldn't worry about it because I don't think anybody's going to believe this little girl. I mean, the DA has dropped John, the charges, John, right? John, they said they didn't want to talk about it. Okay, so we won't then. What a strange expression you have. Uh, what are you thinking about? You know, I, I was thinking, I am so glad that Lily and Holden finally got married and Lucinda didn't do anything to make things unpleasant, more so than usual. Well, she couldn't, because uh, she knew that if she pulled something, then I would have gone straight to Lily mm -hmm. and told her that, that Lucinda offered you your fortune to take. Wait, just... <laughs> Oh, this is the lady you should be taking pictures of. Oh, yes. You look adorable. I love you in that dress. Thank you, dear. <laughs> <laughs> so, Andy, were you and Lisa talking about Julie yes. and her baby? Yes. Well, no. Actually, we were just we were talking about how wonderful it was that the wedding got off without a hitch. Right. Yeah. More lies, right? Yeah. You know, I saw Holden with the baby earlier today, and I just can't help but wonder. I just can't help but wonder if you would really thank him for all that he's done for him. <laughs> You're on, guys. difficult because I know things that you don't know. Remind me, I gotta ask her about that later. Thank you. 
Does the sniffling and sneezing that's keeping you up at night tell you your cold pill isn't doing all it should? Does your coughing and sore throat give you the feeling those tiny time pills aren't so advanced? Then it's time to try the new NyQuil Liquid Cap. It has the relief you expect of liquid medicines for coughs and sore throats, plus relief for sneezing and congestion. The Vicks NyQuil Liquid Cap. The very first nighttime sniffling, sneezing, coughing, aching, sore throat fever so you can rest Liquid Cap. Bills cry for Bounty, the quicker, thicker picker-upper. Bounty's quicker, and Bounty's thicker than any other national two-ply paper towel. The sorriest Bills cry for Bounty, the quicker, thicker picker-upper. Do you get diarrhea, too? Yes, I do get diarrhea, and what I take is kaopectate. I have no time to be sick. Kale pectate stops the symptoms fast. It gets rid of the diarrhea. Kale pectate works every time. Mommy, I made a mistake. Uh, let's erase it. Erase it? Sure. With new Erase Carpet Spot Eraser. Just rub Erase over the mistake and Erase rubs it out. No more mistakes. Erase Carpet Mistakes with new Erase. <laughs> <laughs> Alden! Yeah? You just walked in. Evan, I think your work's pursuing you. Oh, I don't care. I can guarantee you he's not here to see me. And even if he is, it doesn't matter because I don't care who comes in here right now. Uh, Ow! I'll tell you what. Hold it. You're taking her apart. Why don't you break up your wife? Oh. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Excuse me. I need to speak with my sister. Could you tell her that I'm here? Thank you. She's the tall brunette with the blonde guy. Certainly, sir. Hi. You look terrific. How was the wedding? Well, I missed it, but Barbara said it was picture perfect. Barbara, I hope you don't mind. I'd like to work with them. Oh. Good. Well, I hope you're ready to confirm a date and time for your meeting with Walsh. Well, as a matter of fact, I am. Why don't you just call Jade and confirm the date that I gave her? Make sure I have no conflicts. I'll be glad to. And in return, why don't you give Tess a little bit of attention? Now, how am I supposed to do that? Because she's out with a farm boy. Well, why should that stop you? Just go on out there and ask her out to dinner. Hi. I didn't know that you were invited to the I'm not, but somebody has to work today. You look absolutely gorgeous. How you doing? Okay, I'm tired with all the food. Hi, Courtney, would you like to dance? Andy, I thought you had to take pictures. Well, I can take them down. Take a break. No, no, no. Okay. See ya. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you want? That'll be good, Evan. I thought you were covering Holden's accounts, but if you'd rather, I'll just cut in on him and Lily. No, just what, what, you, what is it? It's a question on space age aeronautics. Jerry Hoffman, you can answer by six. Well, well. I see that Marcy's enjoying the festivities. Yeah, she just got to the reception a little while ago. She missed the wedding completely. And she's tied up with some important movement. Hmm. She disappeared from the office for a couple of hours, but I can't think of any outside business that she'd be doing for us. Well, that's really interesting. And you know what else? I found her with Lucinda out on the terrace. They were toasting something. But you and Kirk made a big mistake having her. She's always going to go to the highest bidder. You know, I have since this well, from the beginning. Evan, I don't recall seeing your name on the guest list. Uh, don't worry, I'm leaving. Good, I'm glad you. Oh, it's the last time the three of us met here together. <laughs> I have to let you down. I didn't know who you were. Young Walsh's. Well, to everything. Turn, turn, turn. Mm -hmm. There is a season. Read that. Check it. I'm not going to take it anymore. No more. No more. Sure, Metamucil works, but it's gritty. I'm not going to take it. No more. No more. Don't. Take Citrusel. Or new Citrusel sugar-free. They taste great, not gritty. 
And new fiber therapy is more effective, not even Metamucil. I don't take it anymore. I take Citrus Cell. Citrus Cell and you, Citrus Cell Sugar Free. They really work. And they're not gritty. Now, the first toothbrush creation to clean your back teeth brings you advanced design of leash. With raised rubber ridges for a distinctly different feel. And a slim down tapered head that cleans it even the hardest to reach places. Get your hands on one and feel the difference. Advanced design of leech. Across. Let's play! Yeah! It's as easy as tic-tac-toe, but a lot more fun. Baby toss! Toss across. Bandit, you won! Toss across from Tyco. We are Flintstones Presenting the best Flintstones vitamins ever, now complete with beta-carotene, the nutrient found in certain vegetables kids may not get enough of. Now with beta-carotene. Would you take a chance, despite the danger? Try me. Would you risk it all for one night of passion? Try me. Would you dare to explore the depths of fantasy? <laughs> Just try me. Try them all on Guiding Light. Feeding us this morning. It's breakfast for your head. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You look very, very proud and very happy. Well, I am, I am. <laughs> oh, I think Holden and Lily were just meant to be together. And I drink the yep. happening. <laughs> Absolutely. Did I happen to tell you how much I loved hearing you sing at the wedding? I think this is your third time. <laughs> well, then maybe that'll encourage you to sing at our wedding. What do you think? Are you kidding? I will be so nervous, I'll be lucky if I can say I do. What was that? I do, I do, I do. Oh, now yeah, that's music to my ears. <laughs> but you know, I'm getting impatient. When is Margot going to come back from Des Moines? I didn't know Tom was going to be at this affair. He was. <laughs> Excuse me, hi. Uh, hi. Well, hi. It is hard to show up without Margot after all. Well, I can't say, actually. Gavin, would you mind stepping out into the foyer with me? Of course. What's wrong? I'll explain outside. Excuse me, Josh. Cheers. Mind if we double cut? Ooh, double cut. Double cut. Mm -hmm. How you feeling? Ah, uh, I feel pretty good. Pretty good? Yeah, let's just hope that you guys don't find out that your marriage is illegal. Oh, man. Checked in, made sure of it. Twice. Twice? Kirk, I know that you're still angry at Holden, but thank you very much for being part of this wedding. I also hope that you and Holden can rebuild as a truck to work. Billy, I'm glad I'm here too, but I'll tell you, anything else is in the hands of the guy. Where are you? Oh, excuse me. Holden, Holden. What? What's happened? It's bad news, Gavin. Your friend Philippe has been killed. What? I, I just saw him yesterday. Where? Well, he was at my office. He was asking for a loan. He was killed? Yeah. Well, when? How? It was a couple of hours ago we found his body in the river. Was it an accident? We don't know. We don't have the coroner's report. Listen, is there someone that we should notify? Uh, yeah, I'll call Nicole. She and Philippe were very close. Yes, thanks. Could you make that call from the station? That way I can ask you some questions yes, about Yes, yes, I'm sorry. Of, of course, yes. I'll do anything I can to help you. I just need to tell Barbara. Okay, but let's keep it down. We don't want to spoil the occasion. I understand. Been killed. What? 
I, uh, I have to go back to the station with oh, Tom I and Mark. No, 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 you stay here. I'll, I'll be back as soon as I can. I'm real sorry. We're late, but I, I, I had a little trouble with my trailer rig, you know? Little? It's the only reason on earth we would have missed your wedding. Well, it doesn't matter as long as he's here, you know? Except, uh, that summer in Wyoming was pretty special about me. You know, things went a little wrong. Well, we managed to put things right there. Well, it sure was a, a real important thing for us, too, because if it hadn't been for you two guys, I might never ask Gracie to marry me. Oh, really? <laughs> Claiborne, this is Lieutenant McCluskey, okay, police. We've been trying to reach you for the past several hours. So please, contact me on important police business as soon as you get this message. So is there any word on the cause of Philippe's death? Well, I don't think we should speculate until the medical examiner's made his report. I'd like to call McCall. Oh, I'll go get back. Uh, Mr. Kruger, I'm sorry about your friend. Well, thank you. Any word on the cause of his death? Uh, I'll let you know. I have to speak to Detective Hughes and the DA first. Uh, would all of you uh, please wait in the squad room? Uh, uh, wait one second, Gavin. A quick question. I know that you and Arthur had a meeting with Ellen Stewart and Ralph Mitchell today in your office about the Riverfront Project, but you can, can you tell me specifically when Arthur got to that meeting? Because I called Jade and she wasn't sure. Well, he was late. He got there sometime after 1 o'clock. I was upset because he was keeping us waiting, especially since I had called his machine and he left a message saying he'd be back at 12.15 at the latest. Okay, thanks. Um, why don't you make that call to Nicole in the squad room? Okay. Philippe didn't drown, right? Right. He was strangled by somebody very strong. Crushed windpipe. Must have been dead about two hours when we found him, so that would put his murder at about noon today. But here's something even more important. Murphy and I didn't search the body as well as we thought. Mooney found this all crumpled up in Philippe's shirt pocket. Very fragile from the water. Uh, forensics doesn't think we can get a print off it, but maybe we don't need to. Meet me under the dock adjacent to the yacht club at noon today. I'll have the money, but make sure you come alone because if you tell Daryl or the police, it's all over. Any signature? Single type letter, A. Oh, please, maybe finally we're getting what we need to nail Arthur Claiborne. Okay, things the doctor says. Stay off! Uh, don't cry. Bend over. You gotta go sometime. <laughs> the easy part of a game called Outburst is that you already know the answers. Slang terms of the 60s. Tune in, drop in. It's a happening, man. <laughs> right on. Right on! Uh, the hard part is getting as many as you can out fast. Commands you give a dog. Stick. Stink. Pet. Drive. Uh, kill. <laughs> Try Outburst Second Edition with all new categories and Outburst Junior for kids. Baby words for biological functions. <laughs> If every dog in the world were the same, all we'd make is dog chow. 
with 43 essential nutrients and meat and bone meal for the taste dogs love. But dogs are different. That's why we make Dog Chow, Puppy Chow, Fit and Trim, and Purina High Pro. Vet tested, veterinarian recommended. Why fight the weather? Get this Craftsman half horsepower garage door opener with Sears Best Features for only $139.99. And when the pros from Sears install it, it's an even better value. So why wait? Get to Sears today. If you're not using new advanced cleaning formula Jet Dry Rinse Agent, you're gambling on getting clean dishes. Jet Dry rinses off invisible residues detergents leave behind. Try new advanced cleaning formula Jet Dry and bet on cleaner dishes. This portion of As the World Turns has been brought to you by Tide. If it's got to be clean, it's got to be Tide. We'll continue with part two of As the World Turns in just a moment. Tonight, Jake makes a fatal mistake. Every God-fearing parent in the world wants to crucify you. A good cop going under on Jake and the Fat Man. You'll make it back. Then, massacre in a Texas town. A madman out of control or a deliberate plan? 48 Hours reveals what the police found out. Right after Jake and the Fat Man tonight. This is CBS. Where can you go for a poem? A really great perm with a cut and some style. Perms. And where can you go for a perm without an appointment? Ever. Where else? With a perm plus from Fantastic Sam's, you can afford to look this good. What do you think? This weight loss program offers a solution you can live with. Total flexibility and savings. You'll lose weight, but your grocery bill stays the same. That's what's great about this program. You eat regular foods at home or at your favorite restaurant. Your lifestyle doesn't change, but your figure certainly does. While losing 43 pounds, I was never hungry. Lose all the weight you can with a low service fee. Only $11 a week at Natural Weight Loss Centers. Call 1-800-359-SLIM. I'm Lee Phillips. Support the Five Hospital Homebound Elderly Program in Chicago. Call 1-800-640-0598. Did Patty take Rick on a real joyride? There was more than one kiss. The answer on Love Connection, Wednesday at 3 on Channel 2. And now, part two of As the World Turns. Philippe didn't drown? There was no water in his lungs. He was dead before he went into the river. Well, then how did he die? Well, we can't be specific yet. Look, Gavin, do you know, did Philippe have any enemies? He had his share over in Europe. You know, mostly angry husbands, jilted women. But here in Oakdale, no, not really. Of course, he and Daryl weren't really very close. We'd gotten a lot closer in the past few days. And, of course, then there's Arthur. All right, look, now we know that Philippe was here in Oakdale when, once before. When was that? Uh, late July, early August. I'd, I'd have to check my calendar. And we found a key to a hotel room at the Division Street Hotel. Is that where he stayed last time? No, no, he stayed at my suite in the lake here. Murph. Uh-huh. The hotel said Van Doren left at 11.30, never came back. Tell O'Neill to go over and collect all of his personal effects, see what else you can find. Right. I'd like to pay for any of his unpaid charges. Right. So, Gavin, why didn't Philippe stay with you this time? I didn't invite him. I had no idea who was him coming. Did he say why he was here? He said that he had some things to take care of. What things? I didn't ask. I felt it was better not to look too closely at Philippe's personal life. But I had introduced him to several attractive, wealthy women here in Oakdale when he was here this summer. Detective Hughes. Yes, he is. Just a moment, please. It's Nicole returning your call. Nicole, I'm glad you got my message. Are you alone? No, good, because I have some sad news. I'm afraid Philippe's been killed. No, no, he was murdered. Well, the police don't really know. Yeah, well, 
Arrangements have to be made. Sure been cool with all that. Maybe he and Philippe weren't such good friends after all. Yeah, maybe. No, 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 no. Please don't apologize for crying. I know you're upset. I'll handle things. Okay. I'll talk to you later. Oh. <clears throat> He's in her very hard. But she wants to come over here and take the body back to France. I put my jet at her disposal. Oh, it's a tough trip for anyone to have to make. But at least now we get a chance to ask Nicole a couple of questions. Uh, <laughs> you hungry? No, not really. I was just checking to see what y'all have. I thought maybe I could cook you dinner. Dad said there's plenty of leftovers. Liver and bacon? No, actually, we haven't had liver and bacon since the last time you were out here. But he did say that there was plenty of cold chicken. Talking about leftovers, I want to cook you something. I bet you didn't even know I could cook. Really? Yes. I used to cook in Alva all the time. Now, you and your dad have been so nice to me, having me over for dinner, picnic lunches all summer. But maybe I could fix you something. Test Shelby surprise. <laughs> with bacon. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, that sounds good. But um I'm uh, I'm not really hungry right now. Do you want to uh, do you want to go over these cuties, whatever you, your play no, things, no, right? <clears throat> Let's just relax, you know? It's nice having this place to ourselves, isn't it? Yeah. You're wearing that aftershave again. Is it too strong? I like it. Who could that be? Whoever it is, get rid of them. Come on in. Hey, Hutch. Hey, how you doing? Good, thanks. Barbara said I could find Tess out here. You can gesture. Gestures, the split second charades game. Your teammates try to guess your gestures before the one word clues disappear. Each player has to act out four one word clues before they're swallowed up by the timer. If you can gesture, you can gesture. Gestures, the split second charades game from Milton Bradley. Some people. It's not mine. Crisp, clean dentine. We'll take care of your breath. The rest is up to you. Hi. Hi. Uh, didn't I see you here yesterday? If this is a cold, this is the flu. Mediflu. Maximum strength relief in a convenient caplet. For more than a cold. For the flu. Mediflu. It's good. It's real good. It's home cooking soup. Not hot enough. No? Well, better let me check. Gee, I'd say perfect. Charlie, what, what do you say? Celery and carrots are mighty good. Well, Stan, how about you? Chicken's delicious. Noodles, too. Golly, Fred, looks like you've got nothing to complain about. Gee, guys, thanks for nothing. Don't miss it. Our pleasure. The name is home cooking, and so is the taste. From Campbell's. Glass of champagne? I love some. I'll get it. Vice is the best man and the older brother, uh, the older brother and the cuter brother. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and that is, be honest with each other, share everything, don't keep any secrets. I'm uh, all alone, suffocating with the lies inside. Oh, I've wanted to pull the rug out from under you. Well, if you had, Andy would have gone to Lily and let you know. Oh, I know. 
Ah, but my hand was stayed. No matter. No matter. It's just a very strange day. Little Aaron is the groom's son. <laughs> Truth will out when it does. I just hope Lily isn't caught in this devastating tangled web of lies. Hey, make assistant guy for all these guys so we can find out who the next lucky guy is. Great, great. We wouldn't want to miss that, would we? <laughs> Say, I saw Evan here earlier. Uh, what was that all about? I'm sorry, I missed that. He had a question about the base age aeronautics. Doesn't he ever take a break? <laughs> the problem is he's the client of Holden's that I'm covering right now. Oh, which reminds me, I better try Jerry Hoffman one more time. Whoa, 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 whoa. I thought this was going to be a strictly social event. I know, so did I. So I will be right back. Oh. You better be. You know I will. Nice party. Yeah. Glad to see Lily and Holden so happy. Yeah, me too. I just wish I knew some more people here. I'd like to dance. Oh, I'd love to introduce you around to everybody. Thank you, but uh, how about dancing with a friend first? Sure, why not? <laughs> <laughs> Well, you never did tell me how come you missed the ceremony. Oh, well, my dear husband couldn't just come to a wedding. He had to work a little delivery into it. Well, I didn't see any harm in mixing a little business with pleasure. Yeah, well, you know? pleasure in what we did. Well, I did my <laughs> part. Woody, Woody, Woody. They're getting ready to throw the garter. You're on, buddy. Yeah, I think I'll leave that for the young guy. Just go on. Maybe this will change your luck. I hope so. Oh, how much is the first piece? As long as I've got you here, what do you mean, Magnus, that you know things about Holden and Lily that I don't? I don't know, darling. Oh, yes, now I remember. It'll all come out in time. She's always with the secrets and the innuendo. I much prefer the way you put things on the line. Speaking of lines, why don't you go in the bachelor line? Include me out. said the place was clean earlier. Yeah, yeah, I know he did, but I want to have my own look around, and judging from the notes on his police pocket, this has got to be the place he was lured to and killed. Maybe, just maybe, they overlooked something. I doubt it. We're not going to find it at night. Let's come back in the morning. All right. Good. All right. But, Murph, I want this area cordoned off. You see to that? You Murph, got it. Come on. 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 Did he come off Philippe's coat or the murderer's coat? Have you had your V8 today? Did you know that V8 juice has less than half the calories of that apple? Wow! Did you know that V8 has more vitamins A and C than that tossed salad? Wow! And did you know that V8 is 100% vegetable juice, so it has no fat, unlike that low-fat yogurt? Wow. So how do you feel now that you know these things? Wow. i got to have a V8. V8 is a nutritious blend of eight vegetable juices that taste terrific. Have you had your V8 today? Place where single guys keep furry meat. Refrigerator. Run it. <laughs> the game is taboo. How would you get your team to guess the secret word without using the five best clues? Uh, no, no. They have like a flat face and like a tail that sits out like this. They sing. They swing on a stick. Squirrel. Parakeet. Yes. Lots of layers of cheese and you eat. <laughs> Oh, it's so stupid. <laughs> Spectators watch it. The left side, the right side. The Tennis. Right. Oh, right. swimming. Right. Ping pong. Thank you. Play Taboo at your next party from Milton Bradley. A group of people who do nothing, we pay them to spend our money. Ah, uh, Congress. Congress! I can't wait to use my new Corning Visions cookware. Corning is so smart. They came out with a new cranberry color just in time for Thanksgiving. Yeah, and they made their saucepans non-stick. They must have known you were cooking. Oh, don't forget the Presto. <laughs> you know how antifreeze works. 
The aqueous solution of ethylene glycol prevents the engine's cooling system from freezing or boiling over. Of course, I know that. Everybody knows that. I don't remember Kmart aisles being this wide. No, you wouldn't. They weren't. My mouth is chicken stove top stuffing last week. Stove top stuffing. Oh. And Beth Turner invites me over for chicken stove top the same night. Chicken My Beth. So I'm thinking stove top with the smell of the onions, herbs, and spices, and then it hits me. What? what? We always eat at six. So? so? So I expect to make it at eight. Oh, no! You can never oh, get right. enough stove top stuffing. Check our box for the recipe to make stove top right in the bird. So who are all these people? Maybe I can help out, too. You know, actually, there's a part in there that's perfect for you, Alan. Which one are you talking about? Well, you said that this starts off with a woman's about to get married. The character I'm understudying right, right. right. Okay, so she's about to get married. Right, and she is about to marry this really successful business. But man. he's really... A lot sort of like <laughs> Evan. Yeah. As a matter of fact, when she was describing the play to me, I thought of you right away. Uh, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> so where, where do we start? Oh, enough of this play. I'm so sick of it. Or did you just come over to help me with my lines, Evan? No. Huh? Well, actually, I was hoping to take you out to dinner. Oh, well, I'm sorry, but I already offered to cook Hutch dinner tonight. Well, like I said, I bet, you know, there's plenty of leftovers. You guys, go ahead. We can do it some other time. No. You want to join us? Uh, three's a crowd. Some other night? Call me sometime, okay? I will. Bon appetit. See ya. Why don't you call Jade, make sure there's no conflicts with the date I gave you. And in return, I hope you'll give Tess a little attention today. Uh, you, you know, on second thought, I don't have any plans. I'd, I'd really appreciate it. And then after dinner, maybe you'll let me play that successful business man. Uh, that is, if the offer still stands. Well, okay. I'll start cooking right away. Thank you. You all right, sweetheart? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. I just needed some pressure. Is it the trial? No. And we said we weren't going to talk about that today. All right. What is it? Well... Every once in a while, when I catch someone's eye, it seems like they either look away or smile too much or something. You mean like Lisa? Well, Lisa's one. Who else? Never mind. I know. Now that Gavin Kruger has returned from wherever he disappeared to. No, no, actually, I, I hadn't even noticed Gavin, but... Lily and Holder's friends from Wyoming. I saw them looking at us while we were dancing. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. People are just jealous because you are so extraordinarily beautiful. You know just what to say, don't you? Right now, I feel like hmm. dancing. Mm. Hi. Gavin? I turned around mm. and you were gone. Oh, I'm sorry. I just needed some time to think. I should have told you about that letter. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't be silly. Of course you should have. Barbara, you don't think... Darling, you have to know I had nothing to do with Philippe's death. I was just afraid that you had done something foolish to try to protect me. I love you. And of course I want to protect you, but... You have to know that I am no murderer. I'm sorry. I was just afraid. Don't worry. Don't worry. There's nothing to be afraid of. Well, there's no need for you to stick around. There's no telling when Margot will get back. 
Well, come on. You know, you'll be a lot more comfortable at home, and I'll keep you posted. Matt, I'm not going to go anywhere until we get some news. Me either. I want to be here when Arthur finally gets booked for murder. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Find something? Yeah, somebody lost a button under the dock and the note told Philippe to go. Now, Murph is bringing up the trench coat that Philippe was wearing. Here it is. Great. I can take a look, but I don't see any missing buttons. Look, these buttons don't even match. That's all right, that's all right. Now, the question is, what's the story behind Arthur's trench coat? You know, I think it's time to give a call to Mr. Claiborne and see if he's home yet. He's there. Obviously ignoring your messages, Matt. All right, Murph, let's go. All right, hey, going, yeah. hey, be careful. Yeah, be careful. Bye, guys. See you later. A new American cheese snack idea. Grill it up and slice it up so little fingers can pick it up. Cut it up, fun it up, guaranteed they'll eat it up. Mm. American cheese. Kids are up for it anytime. Need a smaller upright for a small place? Get a Dirt Devil Broom Vac. Want a second vacuum upstairs? Get a Dirt Devil Broom Vac. It's the powerful upright that's small enough to use anywhere because it's a Dirt Devil. Do you suffer from irritable bowel symptoms with abdominal discomfort and alternating bouts of diarrhea and constipation? Discover Equilactin for effective relief from irritable bowel symptoms. In an irritable bowel, stress can trigger a flare-up causing a water imbalance in the colon. Too little water, constipation. Too much water, diarrhea. Equilactin equalizes the balance and provides welcome relief. Yeah. Easy to carry, easy to chew, Equilactin tablets. Effective relief from irritable bowel symptoms. To make my nachos, I lay the chips down with a curl safe enough and heap on so much cheese, salsa, refried beans, and jalapenos, you can barely lift a chip. But thanks to Palm Olive, lifting off the goo from the dish is no problem. It even gets up the stuff that was zapped on from the microwave. And Palm Olive softens pans while you do dishes. So, before my tongue cools off, I'm already finished. Palm Olive, you cook, we'll clean. Sounds like the kind of music your grandmother's always listening to. Listen, I'll be in my office. Let me know when Margot gets back, will you? I'm starved. I'm going to the machine to get a candy bar. Anybody want one? No. No, thank you. Oh, this waiting around is driving me crazy. Hey, look at this. Don't do this to yourself, honey. I know. I know that this whole nightmare is going to be over soon. Well, I hope you're right. I think we could use some good news. You know, with the holidays coming up and that baby do. I think this shadow's been hanging over us, finally lifted. It's so strange. What do you mean? Well, I... Philippe and I were always quiet enemies, and now he just may be the one that helps us nail Carolyn's killer, even though it may have cost him his life. I didn't. I haven't had a chance. Well, you'll Why? find a message on there from Lieutenant McCloskey. Something about the case? I need you to come down to the station and answer a few questions. What about? The murder of Philippe Van Dorn. What? Oh, don't pretend, grief. We know you weren't close. Yes, it's true. I had his guts. He married Carolyn for her money, then made her life miserable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll talk about it down at the station, all right? I will. Well, let me get my coat. Yes, by all means. Cheers. 
$75 value, your gift with any $12.50 purchase from the Ultima 2 collection at J.C. Penney. I'm dreaming of summer, cool breezes, fresh air. When I want that feeling, summer's here, catch me there. Spring, fresh feeling, keeps the good times on my mind. Summer's here, you bring back freshness and shine. I swim, I jog, I love junk food. Sometimes even I get constipation. When it happens to you, X-Lax pills give you a choice. Extra gentle for a little help, regular for a little more. X-Lax, for regular people who sometimes aren't. Some days my minor arthritis acts up, and I really feel the pain. I used to take aspirin. Now I switch to Advil. Advil relieves the pain in my stiff joints. In fact, one Advil is as effective as two regular aspirin. And Advil is gentler to my stomach. Maybe that's why doctors recommend Advil for minor arthritis pain more than any other brand. For my pain, I simply prefer Advil. Advil, advanced medicine for pain. Have you seen the show the critics call the season's best new series? We're coming. Hi. 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 Brooklyn Bridge, tonight at 8. As their love grows... Go now. What will she do to get him back? Hello. Is anybody there? An all you not landing Thursday. This portion of As the World Turns has been brought to you by Advil in tablets or caplets. Advil, advanced medicine for pain. Regine's first love connection date was a real bomb. Was her second a romantic explosion? Find out on Love Connection today at 3 on Channel 2. Goes by Raffinati. Join us tomorrow for the Emmy Award winning As the World Turns. This is CBS. Today on Channel 2 News at 4.30, smash up on the south side. Two school buses collide, 25 injured, four seriously. But it could have been worse. I'll tell you why most students escape serious injury. Then, the bitter cold takes its toll again. A dramatic waterfall from a high-rise flood. Also, food labels. What you see isn't always what you get. Today, why confusing labels could be a thing of the past on Channel 2 News at 4.30. Last month in Chicago,